Hello, and welcome to Start Your Workday Mindfully, a daily Nyapers 15-minute retreat. My name is Ruth Colon Wagner, and today is Friday, April 10th, 2020. Thank you for joining us. So let's get started. I recently heard of someone's self-described traumatic experience with mindfulness meditation. He said he was led to meditate, and after 55 minutes, he couldn't go any longer and informed his teacher. Instead of praise and compassion, his effort was demeaned because it was just shy of the one hour mark. Instead of praise, he was belittled. In all honesty, I see only his success and a significant one at that at 55 minutes. However, now this person forever connects mindfulness meditation with trauma when he experiences what really should be the opposite of trauma. It should be a healing experience. It just so happens that this person is actively working to move beyond this experience and has immersed himself in the teachings of self-compassion. Something wonderful came out of this experience. It's a lesson for me, really, when I hear this story, more of a reminder, actually, that everything that we do and say impacts other people, whether you're a mental health professional like me or not. We each have enormous power, and we exercise this power in the language we use and the way we connect and support and guide people. So how can we help all people to be their best? to live their best life, whether we are close to them, know them in passing, or don't know them at all, let's practice kindness and compassion. And I know this is not always easy. Our negative feelings can usually lead us to walk in anger or resentment or even fear. And this is when we can take it out on others, whether that's an unkind word or a roll of the eyes to someone on the subway, for example, or in the car next to you. What I find helpful is reminding myself to breathe when I'm upset. Through regular mindfulness practice, I recognize more and more every day how beneficial my breath is to me, to this practice. And obviously, yes, my breath gives me life, but it's the natural rhythmic nature of my breath, of our breath. It helps to calm me and to center me so that I can think clearly, think without emotions, you know, those knee jerk reactions that sometimes come and that most times is just not helpful to anyone. And thanks to my smartwatch, I have an app that reminds me to breathe. Surprising that I really do need reminders to breathe, even though I breathe all the time. By doing this, I recognize that one moment, find my breath, and instantly feel a moment of calm. It's a beautiful thing. Let's practice. For this meditation, you can choose any position you find most comfortable. And some people even choose to do it laying down. And if you're working from home, I won't tell on you. When ready, And if you're comfortable, close your eyes and find your breath. Breathe naturally and at your own pace. Feel your body breathing for you. It's feeding you with every inhalation you take. Take your right hand and place it on your abdomen. Observe. What do you feel? A gentle rise and fall? Maintain focus on your belly and continue breathing. Feel the texture of your clothes 
as your hand sits there. What do you notice? Maybe soft fabric, buttons, a zipper. Just observe. Be aware of just the sensation of touching. And breathe. Now, turn your attention back to your breath as your hand remains on your belly and observe. What do you notice? When ready, raise your left hand and place it gently on your chest. Your breathing is most noticeable here. Both hands are feeling the rise and fall as your body breathes. It's a wondrous miracle of life. Next, let's move towards your neck. Slowly, move your right hand from your belly and gently caress your fingers along the front of your neck. The rhythm of life is so powerful here. Against your fingers, the rise and fall of your breath is more noticeable, more impactful. Notice anything else? Do you feel the beat of your heart, your breath and your heart giving you life and energy? Both hands right now are experiencing the wonder that is you. Enjoy this gift of life. Feel the power that you have on this earth. The power of life, yes, but also the power of compassion and the presence of joy. Joy because you are in the moment and are ready to approach today with the knowledge that you are special. There is no other you. As you go about your day, allow this moment to remind you of your compassion towards yourself and towards others. Your breath is powerful. Experience this moment again, anytime and anywhere, just even only using one hand. Find your breath, focus, and center yourself. Experience the calm that it brings. When ready, you may open your eyes and see today as brand new. As always, you can contact me anytime at mindfully at nyappers.org. Follow us on social media using the hashtag mindfully nyappers. And together, let's spread the word. Let's pay it forward. Today's inspirational quote of the day is, in a world full of doing, 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 it's important to take a moment to just breathe, to just be. Thank you and have a beautiful day.